got my bags packed, I'm on a roll I'm heading out there and I'm ready to go I'm looking real good in my passport photo On my recent trip to Maui, when I was a guest of the Maui Visitors Bureau, I had a chance to go to the 18th Annual Celebration of the Arts at the Ritz-Carlton in Kapalua. I think it's safe to say I have never spent so much time hearing people chant Hawaiian. This is the opening ceremony, but the first event was actually a sunrise event on Good Friday. This always happens Easter weekend, which involved jumping into the ocean for a ceremonial cleansing or bathing. One of the highlights of the Celebration of the Arts is looking at some of the original Hawaiian crafts, weaving, and then this is a stem that the Hawaiians used and they beat it until it turned more into a paper product and used it as a fabric or a paper. And then using a lot of natural components, they developed dyes, which they could then print onto that particular fabric. Artisans also demonstrated the making of flower lays as well as stone carving, which is particularly hard when you're carving it with stone, and wood carving. And then one of my favorites are the little tiny shell necklaces, very fine handiwork that are made in the island of Ni'ihua. And besides watching people make crafts, there's also a lot of hands-on activities available for adults and kids as well, as well as Native Hawaiian music. And the event ends with a banquet and a show. underground steam for hours and hours and hours and our gentlemen have been doing that over the course of the, the weekend while we're here and uh, it came out today and so it's as fresh as you can possibly get it. Even and the God that travels with you wherever you go whether it is far away from home or whether it is right here at home. Na alma kui po na alma kui keo na kua iluna ilalo iloko iwaho e ma ko ka o ko pula pula e ma ko inu e ma la ma ya ko ma ke ma ke ma ka mua nei e li ke ya i ma ma ya ma ka nila.
This year, the show ended with a preview of the show Ula Lena, which is sort of Hawaiian arts meets Cirque du Soleil. With that, we will end this video episode of The Amateur Traveler. Remember, there are still spots available if you want to go with The Amateur Traveler on an Egypt photo tour this November. AmateurTraveler.com slash tours will give you more information. For more episodes of the video show or the weekly audio show, go to AmateurTraveler.com. And as always, thanks so much for watching.